Another Philadelphia school caught in the middle of asbestos concerns. Simon Gratz High and Middle Schools are now closed for inspection. And as our Hank Flynn reports, this is the second school in about a week now to have asbestos issues. These inspections are taking a toll on Philly schools. Two weeks, two federally mandated inspections, and two schools shuttered for asbestos. Building 21 last week, and just this morning, Simon Gratz. How does this keep happening when well, we've known for a long time that it's a problem? This school has the exact same problem. They told everybody that this morning. Oh my God, really? Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. So which school am I gonna go to? So Maya Easton's mom was trying to transfer her to Simon Gratz from Building 21. They hadn't heard that Gratz was closed this morning. Asbestos. Count her out on going to Strawberry Mansion. I guess I'm going to have to figure out a school down South Philly. I'm not sure. I really don't know where I'm going to go to school. Honestly, I'd rather do homeschool than go to Strawberry Mansion, to be honest. But Mastery statement on Gratz's closure this morning. It says the district recommended closure for the remainder of the inspection and health and safety remain a top priority. Brenda Harris brought up the dozen schools closed for asbestos pre-pandemic. When they would check them before. Remember when it came out with a big thing about it before? I thought they were checking the schools, all the schools. Superintendent Tony Wallington, who assumed the post last June, acknowledged the known problem at a press conference last Wednesday. We're putting people at risk, and, um, and this needs to end. Former Councilwoman Helen Gim was a consistent advocate for public schools before she resigned to run for mayor. Two schools in two weeks for a long-known but unaddressed problem to her spells out no plan. We have made it clear that the district has failed to plan time and time again for known problems that we've got within our schools. Um, it's not that the presence of asbestos has to be the complete thing that breaks the school system. It's that the school system simply does not ever have a plan to respond to any of this. Now, Gim added there's no guarantee that it won't happen again. Mastery Charter Schools told me on the phone that they do not expect students in for the rest of the week, but that is per Philly School District inspection. District spokeswoman Monique Braxton told me quite simply that Philly School District is sharing inspection records and remediation data with Mastery. In North Philly, Hank Flynn, Fox 29 News.